Hi everyone, welcome back to my kitchen. Today I will show you a very unique recipe. Before starting, please turn on captions and select your language in the settings. I translate my content into more than 80 languages. Let's start with adding 600 milliliters of water in a pot. Then wait for it to boil. After the water boils, add 15 grams of sugar, 8 grams of salt, and 10 milliliters of olive oil. Now let's add 220 grams of flour into the pot. I cook this mixture for about 10 to 15 minutes. You can use a wooden spoon or a rubber spatula. I mash the lumps of flour to make the dough smooth. When it reaches this consistency and no longer sticks to the pot, remove it from the stove. Now let's put the dough in a bowl and spread it out so that it cools more quickly. After making sure it has cooled down, sprinkle flour on a clean surface and put the dough on it. And add more flour on the dough. Now sprinkle 10 grams of baking powder on it before you start kneading. Now we can knead the dough. I need it for about 4 to 5 minutes. When the dough sticks to your hands, sprinkle a little more flour. Stop kneading when the dough is soft and smooth. Now let's put the dough on the fluid surface and start rolling it out. As you can see, the door rolls out very easily. Let's put 20 grams of butter on the dough and spread it all over. Now grab the dough starting from the edge. and pin 
touch the edges. Divide the door into 11 pieces. Surface, take one of the door pieces and roll it into a ball. Then start rolling it out. Previously grated 150 grams of mozzarella cheese. You can use any kind of cheese or mashed potatoes. Sometimes I make mixture of mashed potatoes and dill. It's delicious that way too. I put a piece of cheese in the center of the door and connect the two edges of the door. It's very easy to make because the door takes shape very easily. process for each piece of dough. I really need your support as I'm new on YouTube. Please subscribe to my channel, like and share the video with your loved ones. I would also like to know which country you are watching me from. Please write me in the comments. This is very important for me to improve my recipes. Spread egg yolk on each one. Mix a teaspoon of black cumin seeds and sesame seeds, then sprinkle on them. Bake them in a preheated 180 degree oven for 35 to 40 minutes. When I put the flour into boiling water like I did in the beginning, the buns I bake become softer. I recommend you to try this recipe, I'm sure you will like it. The buns 
are crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. What do you think about this recipe? Would you try it? Thank you so much if you have watched this far. See you in the next video.